Welcome to Fiery Smart Support. My name is Emery, your virtual assistant for Fiery Specialty Applications, and in today's video I would like to show you how to check the TCP IP printer port for Chinese printers. This is part 2 of the 3 videos. So let's get started. In our part 1 video, we showed you how to check if a firewall or antivirus software is blocking the port. In this part 2 video we will show you how to check if the printer control software is not configured to listen to 127.0.0.1, port 9100. In a third video, we will show you how to check if there is a conflict with another program listening to the same port and not allowing the control software to receive the print data. When we cannot print via the 127.0.0.1 port and no firewall or antivirus software is blocking the port, then we should test if we can send data to the port. Windows 10 and Windows 11 includes a Telnet client software. Telnet is the short form of terminal network. It is a protocol that a user can use to connect one computer to a local computer. This is the ideal tool to check if data can be sent to our port. To enable Telnet client you need to open the Windows control panel. Select Programs. Then click Programs and Features. And click on Turn Windows Features on or off. Or you click on the Windows icon and then type in the search, Turn Windows Features on or off. Scroll down the list to Telnet Client. Tick on it and press OK. This will install Telnet. This might take some time. A message will come up, Windows completed the requested changes. And Telnet is installed and ready to use. The next step is to use Telnet in the Windows command prompt CMD. Right mouse click on the window icon and click on Run. Type in the letters CMD and click OK. The command prompt opens. Type in Telnet 127.0.0.1 space 9100 and press Enter. If you get a message, could not open connection to the host on port 9100, connect failed that will mean that you will not be able to print to 127.0.0.1. When the connection failed, it might be due to one of the following causes. The printer control software is not running. The printer control software is not connected to the printer. Or the printer control software is being blocked from accepting data from port 9100 by a firewall or by another software. We showed how to test a firewall in part 1 and will show how to check if another software is blocking the port in part 3. If the port does open, you will just see the cursor, and printing to 127.0.0.1 on port 9100, should work. Thank you for watching. Please check our other videos.